here's something I just want to show you that uh, will be helpful to you. And um, that's a quick way to tell whether what you have is just totally not gold or if there's a chance it could be gold. Now, this won't identify whether it is gold, but it'll tell you that it's not gold. Um, what you need is this. Uh, just a really strong magnet, right? And um, what I've got is a bunch of chains I bought uh, over time at different sales. And I'm just going to go through them. And they all look like silver or gold. Uh, and let's see if they are. That one is not. That one is not. And that one is not. Um, one thing about this is don't go by the ends. Right? Uh, make sure you test the middle. Because the ends will always have a, like a lock like that will have a spring in it. Anyway, let's keep going. Uh, not. Uh, not. Not gold or silver, not gold or silver. Uh, these are hooking on. Let's just kind of get these out of here. Okay, keep going. Uh, not gold or silver. Not gold or silver. Uh, not gold or silver. Oh, this one just totally jumped. So that is totally not gold or silver. Look at the way it's clinging to my magnet. Um, this last one. and this, I actually bought some of these together uh, with this one. And this is the reason I bought them. Uh, this one is marked 14 karat gold. Um, I put it to the magnet, and as you can see, nothing's happening. Nothing at all. It's not moving towards it at all, jumping in any way. Um, again, if you check the end, it will totally jump to it, but that's because um, there is a spring in that lock. Anyway, uh, now I know that this one could possibly be gold, and all I have to do is get it tested.